So today's phrase is, I have to. Think of something that you have to do in your life. Now just say the phrase out loud. I have to pick up my kids from school, or I have to pay my bills. Say it out loud. How does that feel? I have to is always a form of an obligation and something that we're stuck doing as if we have absolutely no choice. And we always have choices. It's our perception that we don't. So when you say, I get to, instead of I have to, there's a sense of freedom and appreciation that's felt instead. And we love to feel free, right? So appreciation is also one of the highest vibrations in the universe. And we feel that appreciation we create more to appreciate. So think about the phrase that you said out loud before. What do you have to do? Now change it to, I get to. How does that feel? For example, I get to pick up my kids from school. I mean, I have kids who I love, and that time is sacred and special for me to bond and connect with them. Let's try one that might be a little bit tougher to accept. Maybe, I get to pay my bills, right? You have money to pay for the things that you need in your life. You have a mortgage or a rent because you have a safe place to rest your head at night and keep you away from the elements. You get to pay your car bill because you have a car that takes you from one place to another, giving you that freedom of travel. So do you see the difference? I have to comes with a feeling of being stuck and obligated, which never feels good. Whereas I get to comes from a feeling of freedom and appreciation. So catch yourself today when you say a phrase, and this is once not an opportunity to beat yourself up, please, or to be afraid of what you said will create a horrible outcome. Just simply notice you said it, and then replace it with the empowering phrase instead. You're doing awesome, you're doing great. Be ready, because tomorrow's phrase completely shifted my life, and it will change yours if you allow it to.